The static keyword is used to declare fields of methods that can be accessed without creating an instance of the class. Static members exist in only one copy, which belongs to the class itself, whereas instance members are created as new copies for each object. This means that static methods cannot use instance members, since these methods are not part of any instance. Instance methods, on the other hand, can use both static and instance members. The advantage of static members is that given the public access modifier, they can be used easily by other classes without having to create an instance of the class. Methods should therefore be declared static if they perform a generic function independently of instance variables. Static members also have the advantage that they persist throughout the life of the application. For example, we can use a static variable to record the number of times that a function has been called. The default value for the static field will only be set once when the application starts. A class itself can also be marked static if it only contains static members or constant fields. A static class cannot be inherited or instantiated into an object. If we try to make an object from it, the compiler will stop us. A good example of a static class is SystemMath, which provides a multitude of math functions. If we right-click on the class name and go to its definition, we can see that it is made up of only static members and constant fields.